Hi guys, this is yeah something different. What is this thing? Oh, it looks like GNOME, right? So it's um, VirtualBox. It's GNOME on Xorg, right? Because we have lots of choices. When we enter GNOME, we can have lots of things to do, right? Log out SDM and action, right? A long drop down. Wow. I just want X Gnome, right? But got we get all that. So fine, that's the one I choose on virtual machine to be able to work and not freeze. And then we have these menus, those, those, those yeah, the buttons and all that, and the choices here, second one, and so on. Escape. Why am I here? Super X is something that we do. Control T, key binding is not working, right? You need to make the key bindings if you want to. Guake is there. That is usually an F12, and it is. So, okay. Locking my system. It's not gonna work on Arclinx, right? It needs GDM. There is no GDM, we just saw it was SDM. So if you want to lock things, we do have something. Arch Linux logout. And we need the one that's not development. So these are the guys. Git is the one you want. And logout themes if you want to have more themes. But that's not necessary. Let's type in the password this time. So you get a lock mechanism with it. I3 lock color, better lock screen. Lock. The video is about how can I lock GNOME. And yes, I've installed ButterFS because somebody on Discord said earlier on something about ButterFS. So there we are. And we have two snapshots, right? Root and root two there. So I have now an application. Arclix logout. Nope, not that one. Uh, sorry, <laughs> we've renamed it, right? Arch. Linux logout. That's this one. See if you can activate that one, you can actually lock. There you are. GNOME is locked. If I don't type my password, it will not be unlocked. So the only thing I need more settings, something like that. Look at settings in and plasma and so on. Often it's called settings. And have a look what's possible. Do I have some way to tell the system and cinnamon the same keyboard? Keyboard, keyboard, keyboard shortcuts, view and customize shortcuts. What if I make a new con, a new one, right? So these are the, the, the normal guys, but here's the custom shortcuts. So there are a few in here, as you can see. Now Arch Linux key, Arch Linux um, logout is not in there. So I say plus. Now Super X is already something. So maybe Super Shift X doesn't do a thing. So if I launch Arch Linux logout, so find yourself a free key or override the one that's, that's there, right? Of course, but let's not overwrite anything. Just add something. And say, okay, instead of super X, I'm going to super shift X. Super shift X. Arch Linux logout. Add. Stop. Stop. Test. Super shift X. And then we have the lock button. And this, the nice fishies are there, as we call the wallpaper. The fishies, right? Super X. Not working. Well, it's working. It's fine. Keep it, right? Power off, fine. The Super Shift X is something in between. Log out or reboot or shut down or suspend or hibernate. And you, any of these guys, let's see if log out is working. And you're back out. Super Shift X. We got now a an, an locking mechanism on GNOME. Same applies for Budgie, of course, they are similar. All right. So enjoy your systems. The newest release, this one is the one from, uh, let's have a look, click, ISO, boom, 
the one from November 02. All right, cheers.